They are some of the world's most endangered animals. And at this zoo in South Devon, conservation work is taking a futuristic turn. Genetic samples are being taken from animals that are neutered or die in a bid to save them from extinction. For a lot of species, time is running out. Um, we do, you know, we work tirelessly to conserve animals all, all the time, it's, it's what we do. Um, but there are a lot of species for whom the, the challenges they face in the wild um, are particularly pressing. Um, and as I said, it acts as a safeguard for, for these species so we can, we can conserve their genetic material for future use. Samples from these mandrills have already been donated. More than 200 miles away in the Shropshire countryside, the science is happening. This is where an animal's tissue is stored, frozen in a living state at minus 196 degrees Celsius, ready to be used if a species is on the brink of extinction. Charity Nature's Safe has so far cryopreserved genetic samples of 82 species. And if we've got that unique DNA, we can use that in many, many di different attributes. So in theory, in the years to come, we can turn that skin sample into a sperm and an egg, which is quite incredible. But the science is moving at such a rate. If we don't freeze it now, we have lost those species forever. With 40,000 species at risk of extinction, the charity says they need to act quickly. We're at the cliff edge of losing so many species on a daily basis. We have nowhere else to go, so we've got to do it here and now. Uh, whatever it takes, uh, being on the technology side, we have to use those tools to be able to stop them from disappearing. The urgency of climate threats and the destruction of natural habitats are leading conservationists to find new ways of ensuring these animals aren't lost forever. Dan Whitehead, Sky News, in Devon.